Hi everyone, so here we are, my review for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. Let's get into it. Okay, yeah, so this is going to be a spoiler free review. Um, as you can see, I've got a smile on my face. <laughs> now, um, before I begin, please consider hitting the subscribe button, liking, sharing the video, leaving me a comment, all that. Let's, let's just get into this film. So, okay, now like I said, it's going to be spoiler free. I won't spoil nothing. Um, I will mention things that are in the trailers um, that you, if you've seen the trailers, you will know. Um, okay, so what can I say? This this was good. This was fantastic. Um Obviously, it's about a two-hour runtime. It doesn't overstay its welcome. It is action-packed from beginning to end. It has got some fantastic visual elements to it. Um, beautiful, beautifully shot. It's you know, and the effects are just superb and amazing. Um, where do I begin? Um, you know, okay. You really do need to have seen One Division and. Um, Marvel's What If to get the most out of this series. Um, I will say that that is probably a downer point in that some people who haven't got Disney Plus probably haven't seen those. Um, so that is unfortunate, but you don't let that detract you. It can, you can be watched without, but it, it is a continuation of the storyline from that with um, Wanda. Um, you know, <laughs> there are elements from episodes of. Um, Marvel's What If that come into play. Um, you see variants of characters that you've seen in that. Um, the latest trailer did show um, Captain Carter. Um, there are other appearances, cameo appearances from characters you might not expect, characters you might expect, characters from a historic Marvel TV series, um, all this sort of thing. Um, so that's all fantastic. Benedict Cumberbatch is on point in it. Um, he obviously gets to play a couple of versions of himself, which is great. Rachel McAdams has far more to do in this than what she did in the previous Doctor Strange film. Um, Wong is fantastic in it. Um, the character of Mordo, um, although not a continuation of the story from the first Doctor Strange film, um, he's there propping up events. Um, it's a fabulous, fabulous film. I enjoyed this far more than what I enjoyed Spider-Man No Way Home, I will say that. I've been looking forward to this far more than any Spider-Man film because Doctor Strange 1 was 2016, which was six years ago. And now we've only get... I know he's appeared in other films, but this is Doctor Strange. This is... Some of the imagery, like I said, is just spot on. The soundtrack is superb. Um, there's elements that you'll hark back to with 20th Century Fox days. Um... Yeah, there's, you know, I don't want to say too much. Um, there's a fabulous fight scene towards the towards the end of the film where music is utilised as a weapon, and you'll see what I mean when you watch it. Just spot on, and and oh, this this film just it's fantastic. It's fan. There's a, there's a tragedy to it as well. There's a tragic tale within it. I won't say who the primary villain is or anything like this. That will be a surprise for you. Um, but I will say that when you come out of this, you understand why um, you won't, you know, if, if, no, I can't say it. I can't say it. I'm not going to say it. I'll give you a spoiler review in a few days time. Just know that this film is fantastic, spot on, superb fun um sam raimi's on point it does delve into kind of delve into that marvel zombie episode of um what if so if you haven't seen what if you need to go and see it if you haven't seen wandavision you need to see it blimey just get get disney plus for a day now get disney plus you know just go on for one month Go to Disney Plus for one month and binge all this stuff. That's all you need to do. There's so many series on there. You know, that's all you need to do. And and because it will, you know, and I'm glad that the, the What If cartoon series is being recognised within the films. I mean, I know it would be, but it's just fantastic because people dismiss it because it's animation. But no, but this film is just, oh, I'm in love with it. It's just fantastic. Spoiler review to come. I'll give it three or four days. Maybe at the weekend, Sunday or something. This is AJ. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Take care all and goodbye. Oh, and one more thing. Yeah, yeah. 
There is a, a cameo appearance by a Sam Raimi alumni actor. Groovy. See you on the next one. Take care all and goodbye.